What's up YouTube world? I want to talk to you guys today about some really interesting article I read. Um, it's called Cool Material. So coolmaterial.com 15 classic cars that dis define cool. So we've overheard guys say they don't uh, care what kind of car they drive as long as it gets them to point <laughs> between point A and B but if you think about it <clears throat> you want to be that cool guy that pulls up in that DeLorean that's kind of a classic 80's car that you don't really see around much but it's pretty cool when the door opens up from the side that's pretty cool and when you pull up in a classic 1960's style Corvette when it's nice, small, and sporty, and it doesn't have the hard top, but it has a rag top. And you have the, the top down, and you're driving around town, and people love to see in stuff like that. So, uh, some of the old classic cars that define cool is like a 1966 Shelby 427 Cobra. Now, I'm telling you, if I saw myself in something like that, that would be pretty cool. Um, how about the 1961 Jaguar E-Type? Kind of the long front and um, kind of a hatchback style. I, I guess that's how you describe it. Um, sedan, not a sedan, um, a coupe. Um, it, it's just really interesting. It doesn't matter how you pronounce Jaguar or Jaguar. Um, everyone's going to agree that that was a good year for Jaguar. I think it was in um, a James Bond. How about a Maserati, 1969 Maserati, 4.7 liter. That thing, nice long front, it kind of looks like a, um, what do you call it, a a Ferrari, I would say. But a lot of the Ferraris and uh, European style cars look very similar with the long front and kind of the seat kind of in the back with not a trunk there. Yeah, at least it didn't look like a trunk. 1964 Aston Martin DB5. Um, and it's a James Bond. It wasn't a James Bond film. Isn't that awesome? Let's see, does it say, no? But, oh, it was in Goldfinger. What a great movie. What a great movie. So here we go. 1957, Mercedes 300 SL. 1957, Mercedes 300 SL Ghoul Wing. The, the doors open like a wing. It's awesome. The doors are the only reason why this one is the coolest, one of the coolest cars to hit the pavement. How about a 1967, or excuse me, 1969 Boss 429 um, Mustang. I tell you, if you saw me in that, I would be the boss. I would be a boss. Uh, rolling down the street in that. Ooh. 1963 Corvette Stingray. Not bad. Rag top with the top down. You go down the um, 95, 105 in LA, um, 95 up in New York. Just rolling around town in Manhattan, downtown Manhattan, financial district, that would turn heads. That would turn heads. Um, 1969 Ferrari Dino 246 GT. Now that is a red car. It's sporty, it looks nice. I would love to be in that car, driving around. 
go up to uh, the beaches, go down to Miami, go to Miami, and that, I'm telling you, how about a 1966 Alfa Romero Spider, it's red, it's a rag top, and it looks nice. It's perfect for story, storing all the sheets of paper with phone numbers on them. Um, I guess. How about a 1969 Dodge Charger? I tell you, I could drag race down the road on the with a 1969 Dodge Charger. I I could drag race, drag race um, down the. Phillips Road, uh, Route 1 here, and the uh, Duval, Northern, uh, Northeast Florida. That would be a car to go in. You know, obviously you, you want to find permits, or you get permission from the local authorities to be drag racing down a public street. A 1966 Lamborghini. That thing, I don't know, I, I don't really like it. The, the, for me, I, I don't like it. Here's another car that people say is really cool. Here's another car that people say is really cool. I don't like it. It's a 1969 Toyota 2000 GT. I wouldn't own it. But, people like the style. Toyota does a great job. Uh, 1962 Ferrari 250 GTE. I guess it's nice. I didn't like that that year, that style. It's kind of boxy. For a Ferrari, it's kind of boxy. 1970 Datsun 240Z. That looks looks nice, but whatever. Now here we go. 1969. Shh. Chevrolet Camaro. That car I could see myself in. Driving around town. Can that classic car look? Not just classic car, not just classic car, but American classic car. Not the, the foreign stuff, but American 60s classic car. That would be nice. That would be like in American Greece. I, I think that's the, the movie that all these tough guys were in. Now I guess that's it. So if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Like and subscribe. Check this website out. It's called coolmaterial.com. You got a bunch of other stuff. Uh, this article is called Classic Cars That Define Cool. And if you can't find cooler cars than what you find in here, you're just not finding the right cool cars to look at or even drive. And if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Check us out on Patreon and other social websites. And thanks again.